College football coming up on Saturday. Southern Illinois taking on South Dakota State. The Salukis at 2-2. Two two. The Jackrabbits 3-1 coming into this game. And South Dakota State still number three in the FCS national rankings. Both teams were off last week and they get play started in the Missouri Valley on Saturday. It is the Hobo Day game. Homecoming at South Dakota State with a 2 o'clock kickoff. And the Jackrabbits have won the last three games in this series, including 57-38 last year in Carbondale, Illinois. Taron Christian threw for 300 yards in that game. Kay Johnson had seven catches, two of those for touchdowns. And the Jacks ran for 300 more yards, racked up over 600 total. Pierre Strong had 188 yards on the ground and three touchdowns for the Jackrabbits. Southern Illinois, though, racked up 350 yards rushing themselves. 200 of those by running back DJ Davis. Davis uh, was off to a great start this year again with 362 yards in his first three games, but he is out with an elbow injury right now and will not play against the Jacks this Saturday. But the Salukis do have another uh, very good running back and redshirt freshman Javon Williams. He is six foot one, 240 pounds, and he's got six rushing touchdowns already. They'll give it to him uh, just on a handoff. They'll run him out of the Wildcat formation on occasion as well. Well, Southern Illinois will play without its top quarterback too this weekend. He started the first three games, but is out with a shoulder injury. Uh, so Southern will have a junior college transfer making his second start for the Salukis in this game on Saturday. As for the Jackrabbits at quarterback, redshirt freshman J uh, Jabori Gibbs is back. He injured his pinky finger on his right hand, his throwing hand in the season opener at Minnesota, sat out the next two games, and then Gibbs worked with the SDSU trainers to make uh, his return to the lineup two weeks ago. With Charlie, our trainer, he was just like, if we can keep our the progress that we're doing right now, we should be able to get you a game at least to you know get that connection with everyone and still get a game before actual conference so you're not like, you know, too laid back, not too laid back, but you know, not too much out of the game, still be have a game or two under your belt before you actually get into actual play. So, you know, I think that was something that we really pushed, like during me trying to get back in my pinky and stuff in my hand. So, you know, that helped a lot. So important for Gibbs to get back and get that game in against Southern Utah. He was uh, 15 of 24 for 215 yards, two touchdowns, but two interceptions in that game as well. And turnovers is one thing the Jackrabbits do need to clean up right now. They have fumbled seven times in the first four games and uh, lost four of those, and they are minus one in turnover margin right now. And the last thing on the Southern Illinois game, uh, both teams can put up points. The Salukis averaging 32 a game, the Jackrabbits averaging 35 a game right now. The difference is on defense. Southern Illinois giving up 30 points a game, and the Jackrabbits just 12 a game right now. But uh, that was in the non-conference season. Now we get to the real games, the eight games in the Missouri Valley Conference. Southern Illinois at South Dakota State, 2 o'clock on Saturday in Brookings.